Hey guys, welcome back. So, been a little tired this week. It's been hot, been having some pain, so it hasn't been the greatest week, but I'm getting through it. Um, for today's video, I kind of just want to talk to the people who are newly diagnosed, maybe looking into what MS medication they're going to consider taking. Um, and the reason I want to do that is because being in many different MS groups on Facebook and whatnot, you come across people posting in regards to medication negative things. And I feel like for someone who is considering going on a medication but unsure of it, seeing these few negative things could really scare you um, and prevent you from making a decision to something that may potentially benefit you uh, for the sake of your health and the reason I say that is because um, in one of the larger groups that I'm in which is an amazing MS support group on Facebook there's thousands of people in it and somebody kept sharing an article in regards to Ocrevus and the person running the group kept taking it down because they didn't feel it was appropriate to be sharing the article. So just briefly what it was is it basically was saying that the person believes that Ocrevus can lead to cancer, okay? And so I was like, I need to read about this because if you've been watching my videos, you've seen recently, I talked about the Ocrevus clinical trials they've been doing and this drug is being very successful. People with MS are having great success with Ocrevus and it's really helping a lot of people and it seems like a lot of people are going to be switching to it if, if they can or if their current medication isn't working because it is really successful. And there's this article out there that said a small clinical trial was done and for the people who were taking Ocrevus, 0.5% developed cancer. There is no nothing in the article to say this is why we believe it's causing cancer this is what could be happening with it and i mean let's face it a lot more than 0.5 percent of people in the world develop cancer ms drugs don't prevent you from developing another disease you can potentially develop some sort of other chronic illness with ms um, that drug you're taking is not going to prevent it and I can understand why they didn't want that up there because as I said, Ocrevus is so, uh, has been so successful and for somebody considering it, you might read something like that and it really could steer you away from choosing a medication that really could be beneficial to your MS. And I just want to remind people out there, um, yes, it's good to do your research when you're considering an MS medication and it is good to reach out to other people that are taking it that's what I did. When I decided that I was going to go on Obagio, I reached out to a whole bunch of people in an Obagio group to, to find out their experiences on it because it makes you feel a lot better. Uh, majority of the time, it's positive experiences and people are doing really well on these MS medications. And you can allow one person or one article to... Um, scare you off from taking a medication that really could help you in the long run. So I just want to remind you, you know, when you are making that decision, make it for yourself. Um, it is good to read about the clinical trials and everything that's going on with that, which I did for many of the medications. Um, things like side effects always can be scary when you read about it. There's going to be side effects with any medication you take, uh, but you need to make the right decision for you. Um, the support groups that they have for chronic illnesses are wonderful because you can uh, connect with so many people that understand what you're going through and it makes it a lot easier um, especially if you're newly diagnosed I know it really helped me when I was diagnosed with MS and so I really just wanted to say that in today's video don't listen to these certain people um, it's it is super easy also to get offended um, for people who are negative about it listen there are so many people out there as we all know that think that 
all sorts of medications uh, have no purpose. It's just for the big pharmaceutical companies to make money and make us sicker. There are lots of people who believe that about MS drugs. I remember when I was first on Obagio reading something somebody had posted saying exactly that and I got really offended because I made the choice to be on an MS drug and if you don't think it's right for you, that's fine. But don't uh, make people who have taken that route to take an MS drug and are being uh, are successful on it and it's benefiting their health don't make them feel like they're making the wrong decision and that's with any sort of illness um, just support each other and if somebody's made that decision they can make it for themselves and um, if it's benefiting them then all the power to them um, do what is right for you so I really just wanted to say that today because I think it's really important to remind everybody just block the negative out and do what's right for you talk to your doctor do your research and you'll determine which MS drug is right for you or any other medication that you're considering taking so hopefully you start to feel a little bit better um, it is going to be a hot weekend out there so please stay cool and I will see you next week